All right, Hayley, I'm currently with Andrea, who is the founder and the inventor of the Revolve Air wheelchair. How are you, Andrea? And can you tell us all about the wheelchair, which is right behind you? Sure. Thank you very much for your time. Uh, I'm Andrea Machelin, as mentioned. Uh, I'm the founder and inventor of Revolver. And this wheelchair is basically the world's first active wheelchair, suitable as cabin luggage in the cabin of an airplane. Yeah. How long did it take for you to invent it and to make it? Well, it's a long story. It's been always a beside project during my full-time job as designer. But the time is basically started from 2015 to today, basically, the, to developing the two foldable wheels and then developing the chair and the wheels with the business partners that we have in London and in the Netherlands. And how did you come up with the idea and why specifically a wheelchair? The idea is that micromobility is changing really quickly and people has to travel between train, public car and private cars and airlines. But still, if you are a person with using wheelchair, traveling is a constant struggle. So you need to check in the wheelchair before each flight. You need to drive large cars where to stall the bulky wheelchair. With the Volver, basically, you don't need to check in the wheelchair. So you can go in the cabin without any procedure. And indeed, you can drive any type of compact cars, for example, a Smart or um, an Igo. And you can fold the wheelchair and place it in the passenger seat of the vehicle. So it's much smaller, right? It's 60% smaller than traditional wheelchairs. So the technology, as mentioned, is the two foldable wheels, which allow to have an extremely compact size. And when it's folded, it's basically a one-to-one -one, a foldable chair, um, active wheelchair, that people can use it to travel all around. And, and uh, how about the, the overweight people? Is it extendable? Or? Yeah, basically, as mentioned before, it's going to be um, in the market of the wheelchairs. So it has to be to certified for um, any type of uh, people, any type of size. And uh, that's a requirement also for the certification. Yeah. Uh, my last question is, did you, do you work with airline companies specifically? Yeah, basically, we are working with the European leading uh, airline to test actually uh, the chair in the context of an iPod, so through security check and in the cabin of an airplane, so where you can store the wheelchair when it's not in use. And that's the main target, because we want to uh, work with the user to improve the product before entering the market. Thank you so much, Andrea. Enjoy change now.